and I'm laying in bed and I can't speak too loud because my mom is still somewhere still very close to me sleeping downstairs and I'm looking into this really big flashlight again laying in my bed and that sucks I haven't had time today to make a video and I haven't had time this week to watch the other people's video so I don't really know what the questions are I know that it's about pride so okay um, let's talk about pride um, I don't really feel very proud of myself of my gender identity I do appreciate the fact that I am quite open about talking about um, gender issues, um, but I don't really experience any pride. Um, do kind of feel proud when I'm um wait I'm gonna sit <sighs> I'm not feeling very well so wait this is better <coughs> hi um so no um not really any pride this is such a messy video, I'm so sorry. Um, but I do kind of experience some sort of pride when we're, when I'm like with a lot of other LGBTQ people and we're together and doing things and there's this sense of feeling of togetherness and loyalty to one another and like we're marching for pride and LGBTQ pride and stuff and when I'm with a whole bunch of LGBTQ people I do kind of feel proud of us doing things I don't know his hair the fuck no but um no not really any pride um I think it's awesome if people, why do I have nose hair? I think it's awesome that people are proud of their gender identity or about certain things that they've done in terms of their gender identity. Well, of course, you know, I'm kind of proud of myself for like ever coming out and taking steps to medical transition, even though I didn't know what the outcome of it would be. And I would have never guessed in a million years that testosterone may not have been right for me. So, I'm sort of proud of myself for allowing me to take that step. Um, and I'm proud of other people who are not afraid to show their true colors and tell educate people about their gender identity and take steps in transition or do not take steps in transition and just do whatever the fuck they want I'm proud of people who do that yeah that's really all I wanted to say because right now I'm laying on my stomach and I'm still looking into this big flashlight talking with a very silent voice quiet voice mm. and I'm not feeling very well like physically a little bit sick and my, my tummy hurts so now that I'm laying on my tummy it gets even worse 
so I can't stay like this forever. But you know, if I go, I'm going to lay back on my lay on my back again, the flashlight is going to be shown in the hallway, and my mom might see that, so she might come upstairs and smell that I just smoked a cigarette in my room. Yeah, that's really off topic, isn't it? Sorry. Sorry that it's Friday. Sorry that I'm not really able to say anything useful about this topic. Sorry about my... The fact that I can't edit my videos. And I'm sorry that you're probably gonna have to turn up the volume again. And now I'm getting a little bit nauseous because there's pressure. Oh my god, my boobs. Pressure on my tummy. So yeah. Just go and be proud people. Be proud people. Be proud people. Oh, I once participated in a gay pride when I was 18 or 19. On a boat in the canal parade here in Amsterdam. was a gay lesbian boat, but who cares? So go and be proud people. And I hope to see you next week when I'm not feeling so nice.